My guy. It's cool. I bless you with a free haircut, man. Thanks. All right, let's do it, man. I brought my own chair, too. I got you. Yeah, we'll use your chair. Don't worry. <laughs> what is your name and what do you do? Uh, my name is Marcus Williams, and what do I do? I live like in a powerful way, but people know me for being a golfer. Yeah, I've been playing about four years. It's this chair that stand me up and I compete. Man, that's what's up, bro. Well, you say you live in a powerful way. What do you mean by that? I show up in the face of adversity every day. You know, no matter how I feel, I'm, I'm going to get up and get in action. You know, I believe in action. Living my life powerfully is just being transparent of who I am and what I do. So growing up, what was the vision for yourself? I wanted to be a football player, to be honest. I wanted to go to, go to the NFL. And um, like I said, I had to grow up fast. So I ended up being a UPS truck driver. 2012. <laughs> I got rear-ended by a drunk driver with ended my career. You know, T6 spinal cord injury. What was it for you that was keeping the positivity going? Maintaining your integrity through spirituality. That's what kept me anchored. I had a commitment to life. Positivity doesn't always mean that you always happy. It's just showing that you can show some resolve when things aren't going your way. For you, what is something that you're proud about the most? That I kept going. Not even that I kept going, that I keep going. My slogan is live your day overcoming. I say despite the wheelchair that you see me sitting in, in my mind I'm walking. And so it's a mental thing. Damn, I love that bro, you're still walking. Absolutely. I don't believe in being in, in disabled. You're disabled and alarmed, not a human being. And so you can choose to be uh, disabled as a person, but that's just mental anyway. There's nothing that you can't do. I love the way that you put that bro. All right, being from Oakland, let me get your Mount Rushmore of Oakland artists. So 40 water, too short. I'm gonna go with Mr. Fab because of his hustle. Well, it would be Mac Dre for sure. But if you wanna say dead or alive, it's Mac Dre. Yeah, I'll dead or alive. Leave. So I'm gonna take Mr. Fab off and put Tupac. So to, to somebody else that is probably facing an injury, what advice would you give them? Every day you wake up, whatever your challenges is, you must believe that you can overcome them. Don't wait to start living. Start living now is so important. You want to reach a certain point before you feel like you can give yourself a break or go experience something. I don't know how we looking. Oh, oh boy. Yeah, that's him. <laughs> it's him? Yeah, it's him? Yes, sir, that's yeah. him. Proud of you, man. Man, for sure. Appreciate it. Likewise, man. Right, no Likewise, problem, man. Sir.